What did it feel like to be chosen for a Taylor Jenkins Reid book adaptation production? That's amazing. I mean, she has so many fans and I, because of this film, got to read One True Loves and have the most incredible experience as a reader. And not only that, the excitement of getting to know that I will be getting to work with this person and bring this person and her world to life was just really thrilling and really exciting. Luke, what about you? Were you like, oh my goodness, a huge yeah. fan? I think when I got, you know, got the job and, and realized kind of Taylor's fan base, there was a, a short moment of um, terror. <laughs> right, in pressure. The, in the way that yeah. the, she's such a popular popular writer and, and people are so invested in her stories and, and rightfully so. So there's that initial moment of, of pure terror of like, why have they chosen me to ruin this? <laughs> um, but... But I, uh, meeting Taylor and 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 obviously Pippa and Simu and, and everyone involved, the confidence they gave me to to kind of take it on and to own it was was really lovely. So Taylor being involved in writing the screenplay yeah. as well as the book, you know, that made me feel a, a, a little safer that she that she'd signed off on it and she was happy with it. So that gave me the confidence um, to kind of get stuck in and 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 really be able to dive into this great story and and this great character. How involved was she on set with you all once you all got together? Was she, you know, essentially making sure that the characters that she created came to light or did she give you guys complete control? Well, right out of the gate, we, we, um, so it was still during, kind of during the pandemic when we were starting pre-production. So, um, right out of the gate, you know, we started having these meetings on Zoom where, Luke, Simu, and I, uh, our director Andy and Taylor and Alex would get on Zoom and just go through the script page by page and get to talk to them about these characters, their intentions, the the book, these scenes as they were written in the book versus how they were written for the film. And it was really like just a wonderful process to be a part of, just like as a as a learning experience mm. to see how you take something that is written in long form as a novel and translate that to the page. Um, so that was quite a treat. And also it was just so valuable because I feel like we got to, in, in those meetings, talk about the characters and where they're coming from and their lives, you know, pre and post this scene and what we're seeing. So when we got to set, it was really just like, you know, launching right away because we had done so much of this table work. Um, so it really felt like we we had set ourselves up to be playful and authentic. We got to like improv and try and find some moments together. So it really just felt like a, such a beautiful team effort that we had built. So by the t built, so by the time we got there, it was just very free. Which scene are you most excited for us to see? I mean, all of them. <laughs> Duh. I, our first day of filming was when I come back. I think it really set the mood for how we were going to work. It was a really kind of collaborative and great idea. We we're really trying to find the the essence of it um, in that way. Uh, you know, I think that's a pretty full on scene, at least for me to be involved. But um, Pippa's got this whole other side of the movie that I wasn't a part of, so <laughs> right. she might have a different answer. No, I mean, that's definitely one scene that I'm really excited for. That was my first day with you. My first day with Simu was uh, his proposal, yeah. Ooh. which uh, was really beautiful and different in its own way. So I feel like I'm excited for both of those because those were both our first days and um, coincidentally also like some really lovely scenes. Uh, yeah, yeah, I'm excited for that. I'm excited for me coming back because I grew a really big beard for it. I'm very proud of my beard. <laughs> that was so good. When you came out of nowhere, we were like, oh, is that real CGI or what? <laughs> That's a real beard. No, that's, that's really me. his beard. We had to, that's me. why we had to shoot it first because that's why we, we shot had on the to first shave day. <laughs> Throw it out. <laughs> that makes sense. That night. Yeah. Some of you wasn't able to be with us today, so I'll ask each of you what was the most shocking thing that you may have learned about working with him uh, that maybe would interest fans. Well, he's a singer. Yeah. I didn't know that about singing. He's, he's, sing. yeah. he's very talented. He's very musical. Yeah. So yeah, maybe that, that people might already know that, but. Pippa and Simu have all the musical talent for me. <laughs> so that's good. They've got so much of it that I don't need any. That's kind of how it goes. <laughs> but you love music. I love music. You love music. I just don't have any talent when it when it comes to singing or being a part I hear of you sing. I didn't hear you sing, so I, I and, actually and can't you judge. Count so. your blessings. <laughs>